in what world does BTS not win Best Performance? In what world? What is super exciting is two years ago, BTS went to the Grammys for the first time where they got to present. Last year, they got to perform under Little Nas. This year, they got to perform their very own song alone and they were nominated for their first Grammy. And that is amazing. If we look at the trajectory, they will win an award next year, but the injustice that the Grammys served is absolutely infuriating. I don't think in the history of the Grammys they've ever used an artist or a band as much as this to promote their show and those people not win an award. They weren't nominated for best song. They have so many amazing songs and I don't think Dynamite is even in their top 10, but they were nominated for best duo pop group performance. Performance, and they didn't win. Look, let's get one thing straight. Nobody is outperforming BTS, especially, I love Ariana Grande. I'm a fan of Lady Gaga. They did not deserve best performance. They performed Rain On Me one time and it was BTS performed the same song 33 times. They performed it in a new way and it was beautiful and I was stunned. I was like, wow, <laughs> they're so good and they did not win. Their live streams on VLive pull in more views than the Grammys award show. So it's just a little something extra at this point. They're bigger than the Grammys, but they deserve their Grammy. And I know they're gonna try to give it to them next year, but like, you should have done it this year. Yeah. Ugh, and then watching, watching them, watching the announcement is so painful. Oh my God. When RM says, I told you. Oh, oh, my heart hurts. Ah, my heart hurts. Oh, Everyone handled it so well. And then Taehyung is just like me. Like, <sighs> brutal. Freaking brutal. Um, so they were nominated or they are nominated for best pop duo group. So we're about to check out the section of the Grammys where they announced hopefully that our, our man's in M1. You know what I'm saying? So we know how BTS feels about the Grammys. They're just so humbled and happy to be nominated. This is something they've been wanting. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping so much that they actually won this, bruh. We're crossing our fingers <laughs> that they won, bruh. I'm so, so nervous, bruh. I'm so oh nervous because I really want this for them, bruh. Me too. And the Grammy Come goes on, to. Come on, bruh. Rain on me. Lady Gaga with Honor Ariana Grande. Lord of Jesus. Well, when I get her name right, I will go get, make sure I give this to her. <laughs> I will accept on their behalf. If I said what I really just wanted to say, like, I only held back because, like, I'd be trying to make this a family-friendly channel. Honestly, guys, but right now, I'm just going to be real with you guys. Like, I don't understand what just happened, and I don't understand, like, no disrespect to any other artists. You know, you know how we are, man. But how, bruh? How? Like, we, we are talking about BTS, first and foremost, who has made an instrumental impact on this world, a meteor-sized freaking impact on this world, bruh. Especially in freaking 2020, bruh. Who else was doing it like that? And then we're talking about Dynamite, bruh? All the records that were bro broken? Like, I never heard of that song, bruh. That, like, like, how, bruh? How, like, how, how is, I don't, I, somebody explain this to me, bruh. Like, I'm really upset about this jump, bruh. Like, for real, bruh, because, like, I was not expecting that at all. Like, I was like, for sure, like they was gonna win, like bro. Y'all just y'all messed uh, up, bro. Y'all messed up again, bro. Y'all messed up. BTS, Lady Gaga and Ariana Grande, Taylor Swift and Bone Iver. Oh my God, it's here! It's here! It's here! It's here! I'm gonna throw it. And the Grammy goes to Rain on. Rain on with honor, Ariana Grande, Lordy Jesus. Well, when I get her name right, I will go give, make sure I give this to her. <laughs> I will accept on their behalf. Harry Connick Jr. James Taylor. Rufus Wainwright. Renee Zellweger. You know that ARMY's kind of like sad not to watch the Grammys because they just played 
I'm like not that good on BTS. So. So, ladies and gentlemen, so let's talk about this. Um, what happened? Am I am I dumb? What's wrong with the Grammys? Like, huh? Okay, just before someone says, "Oh, you're hating." Oh my God, Ariana Grande is so good; she deserves it. I don't say she doesn't deserve it. Uh, I don't say she doesn't deserve it or anything. Like, I don't want to say something like that because every artist works hard for these things. And I'm a I like Ariana Grande, okay? I have been to her concert and everything. I love her. But I honestly don't understand this because... I don't know. I, I, I mean, Rain On Me was good. But it was good. Not to be mean or something, it's just my opinion, but I wasn't blown away or something. Um, she has much more better songs in my opinion. And Dynamite was like literally everywhere. It was like present, it was even present in Germany, guys. That means BTS made it. If they are coming into German TV, it's like, what? You know how often Dynamite came? Oh my god, me as an army, I was like, even my dad listened to it, okay? No, the world doesn't go under with it. BTS is right with or without a Grammy. But let's just say this is confusing. And I have seen multiple videos. And like, I think no one gets it. How did this happen? Immediately after watching the scammies, we wondered how the BTS members felt and how they reacted to the nominations. And the only place my mind could go to was how the members were yeah. feeling because if we felt like this, we can only imagine the members were feeling the same feeling times a hundred. But fast forward 15, 20 minutes, they were posting on Weverse and making all of us feel so much better. Oh, I could feel the tension. <laughs> My heart, because I know the result. Namjoon took like his earpiece yes, out. Yes, just I silence. Tay hasn't even moved. Like Tay's reaction. One more time, Hanuman. Look at JK, he's like, oh! I swear he started praying him. I'm actually so disappointed. <clears throat> I can't even like formulate my words. Are rigged. 100%. Racist AF. Racism. Can we discuss the Grammys and racism for a minute? Because that's what that was. And I love BTS. I love them. I will not support that show tonight. I will watch BTS' performance on my own once it's up. But I will not give that show any viewership. And it's just a shame. It's a big shame. It's a big loss for them. BTS decided to use their frustration in a positive manner. Like BTS decided to say, no, we're okay for us. I mean, they're professional, you know, but you know deep down that they're they're hurt and they're upset. Well, we saw we saw the little Twitter of when they, of their, their live reaction, reaction to it. Yeah, their live it reaction. Well, yeah, it, 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 it hurts does, watching it, it. It does really really hurt. Also, after um, all this, they went live and like basically very very late. They went mm -hmm. live afterwards. And, and you know, they, they look tired, so it was kind of like... Yeah, was, Jimin, was like, I thought, was like, I was like, oh my god, so like, is Jimin, like, asleep over there? And we hate that. We want the, the boys need some rest, bro. And it, and it sucks that they waited, like, that long, too, like, you know? I don't really care. I've never liked the Grammys. I don't watch the Grammys. Yeah, I don't... The really only reason I watched them. was for the boys, like, because the boys wanted... it's want one it. of their dreams. It's one of their dreams. Yeah. Um, they said literally it's one of their final dreams. Army, army, listen, I'm, I'm, calm down. <sighs> breathe, breathe, breathe. Okay, listen. I, I'm happy that the boys got a nomination for a Grammy too, in a main category, at that. But listen, the only reason they did was because they want you to watch the show for views. They're only doing it for money. Because let's be honest, if anything was going to get nominated for a Grammy, it should have been the whole f***ing album because that album is a f***ing masterpiece. And what happened? Nowhere to be found. Just Dynamite. Just Dynamite? Where's Black Swan? Where's On? 
yeah, so don't be surprised if they don't win. Honestly, don't even be surprised if they're the last performance of the night because they want you to watch the whole show for money and then make them perform. And then watch it be like two minutes long. So, ARMY, I'm happy. This is a historic moment, but don't be surprised. If they do win, I will be happy, but I'm not going to be surprised if they don't. Adios.